Hello, 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 everybody. The 30th of May. Yes, this year is almost half over. Um, thank you all for being here. I will, I've will. i got the chat going. Let me make sure I click on it. I also got to make sure that my YouTube's running okay, which it is. Anyway, thank you again for all being here. As you see, we have a special guest. The voice, Robin Noble, is with us today. Um, we know that yesterday we were all in a webinar with our fearless leader, Mr. Ash Mufara. Um, there was nothing written up, so don't worry about that. The, uh, the full recording, the unhinged, truthful recording is in, uh, on, in my YouTube channel, by the way. That's where I put it. So I'll put the link in here so everybody can see it. Uh, I believe that's it. Hold on. Let me double check. Uh, yeah, that's it. I put it in the chat. It's also posted it in, uh, in the back office of, uh, well, both. It's in the back office of OES and um, O-Founders. Uh, emphasize. What's going on? What happened? What was said? Blah, blah, blah. Look, go back and watch it and listen to it. There's one thing I want to tell you. In every company, normal company, and by far we're not a normal company. We are huge and we're global. In every company that, and I work for Fortune 500 company, huge, top companies in the world, no, no joke. And in the corporate side, there's always things going on. Uh, Ash brought up there's things going on. The beauty of it was he says, I have full control. It's that simple. And don't worry about well, what it is, what it is. I mean, we have, a, we have our own lives. We know this. Nothing has changed from what's going on. When the money is back there, we're going to get paid commissions and bonuses. Okay? Wow, now that nothing, none of that changed. All she said was, "We're moving forward. I've got everything under control. What's going on? What the, all the little details? Don't worry. I am stoked. I am. Listen, I feel proud that he came out and told us. Did he have to? No, but he did. Uh, I'll give you an example. We know that one of the best products on the planet, or one of the most sought-after products, is an iPhone. We know." I hope we know, but I'm going to say it. There's people in Apple during the creation of the iPhone. There was some shakeups. Things happened. Why? Direction, vision, all of them didn't didn't jive. That happens in every company in the world. So let's not make a bigger thing out than it is. Best thing you could do: go back and watch it. I tell you what, <clears throat> I went back and watched it, and I was in it. And I, I got a very clear, um, for me, very clear that Mr. Mufara is running this thing. He's, he's passionate as always. Actually, he seemed more upbeat, okay, to me and to a lot of people. So we're here. Um, I'm not going anywhere. I love this company. I love what we stand for. And I think, I don't think, I believe when... When things clear, and the money's there, and all that's there, that we know what they can build because we see O-Connect now. What do I think? I think that O-Connect is probably still not good enough for Mr. Mufaro. That's a plus for all of us. That means his standard of good is way higher than expected. And that can only be a good thing for every founder. Why? Everybody that comes in on passive has to go through a founder. I can't emphasize that enough. And we're in good hands. And I'll tell you something else I know, and this is fact. I've been in for about five and a half years. I have always watched and listened, and I've, it's always been bigger and better than I expected. And... The meeting last week, the meeting before, the meeting before that, and the meeting yesterday hasn't changed any of that. In fact, I'm more powerful I'm here and more in my heart than I've ever been. I'm surrounded with people 
everywhere that I love being around. It's a big family, like you, like everybody knows. This this company is marching forward. If, if it could have been smacked down, beat down, it would have been a long time ago. But it's not. We're all we we got a good captain of the ship. We got somebody that that loves us. We got somebody that probably loves us too much. Huh, really, uh, has done everything for all of us, and all he thinks about. It's what he could do for us because he knows what we're going to do, what impact we're going to have on the world, uh, which was started by him. I love it. He didn't make any of you. We find each other because people swarm towards what they love and what they're part of. Okay. So anyway, love you all. I'm going to turn it over to Chris and uh, take care of something. <laughs> anyway, thanks, Chris. A couple things, uh, Marty. The well, number one, let me say good morning, Robin, uh, my buddy in crime. <laughs> I'm glad to see you're on here, and 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 I want to. I'm going to show some honesty, which I always do. Uh, when I'm on the listen, we had a really crazy day because we had some links mix up. Blame it on me about that. Okay, it was believe it or not, it was hectic because we had people couldn't find the links. It was posted in your. OES back office instead of O founders. So I apologize. That's my fault. I forgot to post it in there, but it was posted in your OS. Listen, pay attention to that OES back office. It's it's really important all the time. Okay. Let me tell you what I think. Um, because I had over 300 people texting me during the meeting <laughs> telling me, Chris, where's the link? And I'm trying to help them. If I didn't get you, I apologize, but it's not always easy because when I'm on the panel, I really want to pay attention. And you've heard us say before, you know, it's kind of hard to follow what says because I got to learn to turn my phone off. But if I do that, I might not be able to help someone. So that's why I don't do it. But so what I did, I got, I think it was maybe 12 midnight, one o'clock in the morning, something like that. I got in my bed, I shut my door. I, my dog was sleeping and I wanted to really hear what this meeting said because i missed ma the majority of it what i found out after watching it three times three times now the first 10 minutes okay let's say 10 to 12 minutes is all i really needed to hear it, it told me everything about what ash Mar far was saying all the rest of it i'm going to be honest and i'm not being rude to anybody that was on there i didn't pay attention to that what i paid attention to was the first 10 minutes and what he said. Um, and that was what I missed. And I wish I wouldn't have missed it because I was not paying attention, of course. Uh, it was very powerful. So I'm going to tell you all this. I can sit here and tell you exactly what I said on that video, but I want you to go look, do what I did. Listen to it a couple times. 10 minutes is all you need to understand what Ash Mafara was saying. Hey, listen, I've worked for Ford Motor Company and uh, I've dealt with Chrysler, GM, all these people. And every once in a while, they got to bring us, they got to bring a big CEO in and say, oh, no, we're going to do it this way. They're going to pay them millions and millions of dollars, all right, to come in and see what's going on. Uh, Ash Bafara is that guy. We're not paying him millions and millions of dollars. He came in, he explained the situation, I thought, which was 100% transparent. And he said this. The same thing he's told us for the last three years or five years. I got this. I'm in charge. No one's going to tell me what to do or how to do. I've got this. He repeatedly said it. I'm proud that he said it. I'm excited that he said it because, like I said, I missed it. So I'm going to urge you to go watch that first 10 minutes, and you'll know exactly what I'm saying. It'll answer all your questions, and that's what it did for me. But I'm saying. The, the love and support for Ash Bafar is, is, is beyond belief, okay? Uh, the people that sent me, I literally got five or 600 messages between the time of the webinar and, and after, and, and I can't answer everyone. It's almost impossible, all right? But I'm going to let you know, the ones that I did see were 100% behind Ash Mafara. You're right, Captain. You got this. And I'm talking about Captain Ash Mafara. To get out there and say, I'm going to do what I got to do. The main thing he said that I loved, I say it differently. He said, 
we got to go back to the roots. I always said we got to go back to the basics. It's something that I worked, lived my life at my job is when I thought something maybe wasn't right and I had to change it, I would always tell myself, Chris, back to the basics. Matter of fact, two years ago, I used to say that all the time on here. Ash Bafara is going back to the basics. He's got the wheel. He's got the lever. He's got everything. Because sometimes in companies, things maybe don't. Listen, he said it. Sometimes we go in a direction and it doesn't quite work out. All right. And the captain's got to say, oh, we got to try something different. And that's exactly what he was telling everyone. So pay attention to the first 10 minutes. Okay. I'm saying it. But I want you to go listen and watch what he's saying. It was very, very powerful, I thought. Very powerful. And again, I missed it because of my phone. And Ash gets mad at me sometimes. Chris, get off your phone. You're right. He's right. But that's what I'm going to say today. I do want to shout out a prayer for Norell Workon's youngest daughter was in a car crash. Pretty nasty car crash. She's, she's uh, doing good. Uh, but always, listen, man, include people in your prayers. I don't care who you pray to, but pray for people. It's a, it's a good thing. But Ash Bafara, proud to be a founder, proud to be a part of a company. I'm proud to know that you're going to take me way past the stars. Robin Noble, it's all yours. Before Robin, before you go, I want to tell everybody something. I'm about to munch down on some crow, okay? You might want to watch me. I did about three or four links yesterday. And I turned, wait a minute, I turned into JoJo the idiot circus monkey, okay? I was getting links mixed up. I was trying, because I tried to do two or three, two or three video um, conference calls at the same time. I was talking to Chris, then I was talking to Rob, and then I went to a quick one, and then I went, so I, I posted our quick one, which was already over, and it was just a, us guys talking about whatever. Then I posted the other one, got the wrong link mixed in, so, the mess up wasn't Chris. It was me. I messed it up. So finally got, I went to ask and I said, can you save me? I'm drowning. <laughs> so he made a link and we got in and every, everything's okay. So as, as Robin comes on and, and chats with you, I will be munching down on some pro. Robin, go ahead. Sorry I interrupted. That's all right. That was a good interruption. Hi guys, it's wonderful to be with you today. And just so that, you know, I'll continue with what Chris and Marty were saying, yesterday's links had nothing to do with me. So <laughs> it's wonderful to be here with all of you. Yesterday was a huge, huge webinar. And what Ash told us really should have helped to reinforce our belief in him and the company. It's business as usual. It's moving forward exactly as what the the pop-up said in terms of what yesterday was about. And, you know, we go through so many things in life that we do just by rote. We, we just glide through so much without fully understanding. And it's so grateful that Ash has taken this mantle on and is looking after us through this amazing company. The company, as we know, is huge. So who better to look after it than somebody with as big a heart as Ash has? with as big a vision as what he has, and he is looking after all of us. Many of you know that I used to work on cruise ships, and one of the things that was extremely important was a dry dock, which is going in for basically a, a ship's checkup to make sure that it was safe to go to sea and it would go through the, the checks and balances, through the engineers, through the technicians, through the sailors and everybody to make sure with something that was called sea trials. And when we went out to sea, after having been in a dry dock or a new ship that goes out, it has the equivalent of training wheels on a bicycle with great big tug ships with lines holding the ship so that it can actually float. And this is how they test to make sure that there are no holes, that everything is plugged, that everything is safe, and that the ship is watertight. This is what Ash is doing. And every once in a while, it needs to be checked in his own books, in his own uh, life and vision of what he has for Unpassive, and the fact that he tells us about it, we're privileged. We're not entitled to getting this information. We should feel privileged that he's actually sharing and trusting us and opening up with what's going on. So this is amazing. And 
these C trials for on passive, we are passing with flying colors. We are smooth sailing. We're just coming around the last bits. And we know that. We were not told anything different yesterday other than it is full steam ahead. The company is in good hands. And Ash is in a good state of mind, which is so good to see and feel and know. Many CEOs, as I said yesterday, bend to the, the, the demands, requests, need to be accepted by society, community, and other rules and regulations. Ash has made the rules and regulations for OnPassive. And the people who joined OnPassive joined because of having a similar heart and a similar feeling about wanting to do good in the world and wanting to help other people. None of this has changed. And so how exciting is it to know that we have a leader who will stand up and will stand for us and representing a company knowing his background and knowing what he is capable of and, ability, and his ability to steer us through rocky seas or you know the, the glitches that can happen in a business that many of us have no clue about. So... Again, as Marty and Chris have both said, please go back and listen to what the, the video was yesterday, what the webinar was all about. You need to hear Ash's passion. You need to hear Ash's words and intonation to know just how strong this company is and to know how strong Ash is in fulfilling his vision and mission to help the world and to help all of us. None of that has changed. So to all of those who were shaky yesterday, uncertain, disconcerted, please put your fears to rest, put them to bed. Prayers, absolutely. But that again hasn't stopped and hasn't changed from where we've been from the moment we knew what was going on and on passive. Hold all of us, all the founders on passive, in love, in God's heart, and continue with prayers for all of us. Life continues. And we are going to continue together moving forward to fulfill what Ash has promised to us, but also what he's promised to the world. So we're doing it together, and I'm so proud to be part of this. Marty and Chris, thank you so much for having me here with you. And I'm just in such a good place, feeling very calm, at peace, knowing that we're moving forward and better days are coming to us. Thank you. Thank you, Robin Noble, for coming as always. You're welcome anytime. Uh, like I said, man, we all said it. Just go watch it. You'll understand it. I didn't hear it. <laughs> and it was, it was a fun, busy day. Uh, but so I want to repeat what he said, but I don't because I want you to hear it from himself. But it really is crucial uh, to what he was saying and understanding. And it's just pretty cool. Marty DeGarmo, all right, you're back. Back to you. Beautiful. Robin, thank you very much. Uh, Chris, thank you very much. It's good to be around people that uh, see. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I always forget. Red will be coming on at 11 o'clock. By the way, newsflash. Red comes on every day at 11 o'clock, okay? <laughs> not Sunday. Not Sunday. Not, not Sunday, but we'll tell you it was Sunday, okay? Yeah, he'll be on. He's always on. He, he'll be there. Um. Anyway. So that's what we have to say today. 500 of you come to see us. I appreciate it. Uh, remember, there's other webinars going on. Uh, anybody gets the question thing, when you're talking to people, don't create more than you have to. It's just very simple. Tell them to go watch the video. Don't try to explain this, explain that. Companies, big companies, I was fortunate enough to be in a large, large company. Things go on. The only difference is the CEO usually doesn't even tell you. In fact, most of the time, you don't even know who the CEO is. So we're fortunate to who we have. I've been on this road a long, long time. Newsflash to everybody watching us, all founders, anybody walking in. I paid in five and a half years, total money out of my pocket, 100 and 43 dollars in five years now you could do the math and you could say i'm getting sucked dry but i was in companies that took that every month for a year and i got nothing 
So this company's not money hungry. If they were, they'd be charging us for O-Connect, and I use O-Connect every day. If they if they can't bring in money for the for us, they're not going to bring it in for them. It's a beautiful, beautiful thing. It really, really is. So be happy, keep moving forward, and uh, we're here to support each other. Uh, I love this company as much as always, and uh, I want everybody to uh, keep the faith and keep any closing remarks, Robin or Chris. Just to say that we chose to come on together today because of the volume of messages that we were getting of people being concerned. And we knew that we know that how we feel sometimes helps others to reassure them. And so instead of trying to respond to all the various single and individual messages, we hope that this would help to just let you see that it's business as usual. We're moving forward. It's a wonderful Thursday. It's a wonderful day. And we will be told by Ash the next steps as they occur, as we need to know them. And we don't need to embellish anything. We don't need to create more words around anything. What Ash says is enough. So thank you, everybody. Take good care of each other and yourselves. Nothing, Chris? Happy birthday if you got a birthday. <laughs> okay, that's... Yeah, happy birthday, everybody in the world. I think probably 10,000 people's birthday. Happy birthday to all of you. Anyway, I will see you all. Thank you very much. We'll be back tomorrow. And by the way, Saturday, we'll have some guests. We're not sure who yet because people can make it. They have stuff going on. So we're working on that, okay? But I'd, we'd love to bring on different people. So I hope, uh, I hope you can make it. Anyway, see you all. And... We will be back tomorrow at 10 o'clock. Uh, what's going on today? Oh, there is a meeting. Uh, I can't, go look in the back office. There's a lot of meetings. Go to one.